Hey, this is Rick Brandenburg for Turf Bugs and Rock and Roll. And uh, I thought I'd start off 2023 uh, with letting a special person that I know talk and give you a little bit of a pep talk. Uh, Bo Barefoot has been involved in the turf industry for many decades in the Carolinas, from golf course superintendent to construction, uh, lawn care. He, he's he's been involved in it. And he, he has a lot of insight. And I bumped to him. I bumped into him in a conference in uh, Myrtle Beach in the fall, and uh, asking if he would just speak for a little bit and give you some words of encouragement as we enter into 20. 23 and uh, I know you'll enjoy it because I couldn't think of a better person to ask to do this other than Bo. So enjoy it and we'll be talking again soon. Hey, this is Bo Barefoot, uh, NC State alumni and just wanted to share with you that I was in the golf course business for and landscape business actually for over 35 years and the changes have been amazing uh, since then. I would like to say we're now in an age of instant information so you can grab this little gadget right here. And you can go online real quick and you can find any information you want to find. I would just suggest that you find scientific-based information from universities in the area in regards to information that will help you establish or grow your grass. I think also with that being said, that homeowners being in the landscape business have more knowledge. They expect more communication from a landscape company in regards to what was done, why it was done, and even where it was done. And I will say that our membership at the golf courses are more educated also, and they also want to understand what is going on. Why did you airify the greens? Why did you fertilize this time of year? Is what you're doing now a benefit for the future, or is it a quick solve or quick solution, if you will? I think the business is growing. We've got more turf everywhere. Soccer is going global. That has been a, a staple around the world forever, and it's really come to the southeastern United States in just the last 20 years. So if you want to be a turf manager, I can assure you, you'll find a great position somewhere in the southeast, whether it's golf course related, whether it's turf related, sod farm related, construction related. It's a growing business. We have instant data. Be a good presenter in regards to what you're proposing for an individual or a company or a club. And just know what's going on in the industry by being connected to your professors like NC State University, Clemson, Ori, Georgetown. There are too many good schools around. Uh, University of Tennessee is at the Carolina show this year, University of Florida. So plenty of data around to figure out what's going on. Look it up yourself. Let's try to find your certified turf professional here in the state of North Carolina if you need some landscaping done and, rep and represent yourself and protect yourself.